Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Sir, hello. You almost hit me. You made a totally illegal move. Away from me, are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. Almost in life, I did not hit you. I said you almost hit me. You made an illegal. Get the off the street with that thing. You're in the street. It's not a car. Oh! Oh! My God! Oh my God! You idiot! Oh! Hey! Don't tell me what to do! You almost hit me! The dramatic woman you hear on screen terrorizing local pedestrians on a rascal scooter is Mobility Mary. Sir? Hello? You almost hit me. You made a totally oh illegal God. move. Mobility Mary, real name Linda Stone, was an elderly woman who attached a camera to her mobility scooter and drove around the streets of Los Angeles, California. She would take her scooter dash cam videos and upload them to her very own YouTube account for the internet to see. Right in the middle of the crosswalk. Mary's original goal in documenting her trips around Los Angeles was to showcase the everyday issues people with disabilities face around the city. While this sounds like a noble cause, Mobility Mary quickly became notorious for her over-the-top reactions to the most simple inconveniences on her trips out in public. For example, watch how she reacts when crossing the road and believes she doesn't have enough room to go up the ramp. Excuse me, I need to go up there, ma'am. I need to get out of the street. Come out the street. I can't until you move Man, out of. You just come on and stop playing. That's a handicap ramp. Keep I can't. Move. Keep I move. can't go over the curb. You're right there. Oh my God. You're right there. You can't move another couple of inches. Okay, so I have to come down. So you just sit right there. You have plenty of room. Just keep going. Just really make it kill. What a bitch. This video was titled, Woman Illegally Blocks Handicap Ramp Won't Move. She clearly has enough space to get up the ramp, but for whatever reason chose to make this a much bigger ordeal than it needed to be. Just like the time she went to Whole Foods and a worker was talking to a customer in a small section of the handicap zone outside the store. You really shouldn't be blocking the handicapped okay. crossing here. Well, the, all any of this, handicap. any of this blue. Right. No right. one is supposed to be blocking it okay, any time. Thank you. I'll take that into consideration. So that's the situation. So, can you please move out of the handicap place? Can you please move out of the handicap place? Okay. Can you please? I'm actually talking. You're you're in the handicap okay. space. People are not supposed to have right. to force you to okay. get out of this by law. Okay. You're not supposed to be take in it up, here. Take it up with management, okay? How about if I call the police? You're insane. Oh, really? Yeah. You're insane. I'm out here doing my job. No, but you're sure. doing it illegally. You're insane. And I'm surprised that you shop here. Okay, let's just see how insane I am. Your insane and I'm surprised you shop here is so funny to me. I love that a massive majority of people that Mary comes in contact with don't put up with her shit whatsoever. Good on that Whole Foods worker for flat out calling her insane. You're insane. And I'm surprised that you shop here. Throughout this video, Mobility Mary is going to demonstrate a clear superiority complex as well as a professional victim mindset. They are quite the two traits combined together, let me tell you what. And I think they are best expressed when Mary is approached by people with dogs on sidewalks. Oh my god. Oh my god, is that dog unleashed? Holy... Oh my God. Oh my God. Is that your dog? Yeah. Not on a leash? No, 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 no. They bite me. This is 
is totally illegal. Totally illegal. And I get bitten, jumped, oh, no! It doesn't bite. I don't care! Okay. This is totally illegal! Okay, you're not making it any easier. Oh, I'm not making it any easier! Mobility Mary is scared of dogs and hates when they're not on a leash. Now, that old boxer was clearly no danger. He, he was not a threat, but she, she acted like it's the end of the world. No! 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 And you know, I'm sure screaming and yelling about the law is the best way to calm down this situation. I'm sure it is. Unleashed dogs is something Mobility Mary takes great issue with. Oh, is that your dog not on a leash? It's not okay, it's against the law. Oh my God. They bite me, they jump on me, they scratch me. I'm covered with scars from dogs. Okay, they're not gonna hurt you, jump on you, or scratch you. Just calm down and just follow the law. It's I a I hope you have a wonderful day it's and a, a great leash. Halloween. It's a You're leash. You're a lovely, thing. lovely person. It's a leash law. It's illegal to do this, ma'am. Imagine seeing these two tiny little shih tzus and having that kind of reaction. It's just so over the top and unnecessary for absolutely no reason. Also, I like that this was another person that spoke to Mary so condescendingly and so perfectly. It was quite the way to diffuse everything. Now, you might be wondering at this point in the video, what does this crazy woman look like? Well, I hate to disappoint you, but the image of Mobility Mary is a mystery. She has never posted a video of herself, and crazily enough, there was never a sighting of Mary in the wild either. The best you get is kind of seeing a shadow of her on the sidewalk. So part of the fun in these videos is kind of just imagining what this woman in a mobility scooter looks like when she argues with somebody on the street. It's totally illegal. Totally illegal. Mobility Mary often treats her rascal scooter like it's a car. There are plenty of videos of her just driving in the road or in the bike lanes instead of the sidewalk. And Mary's constant habit of doing this would lead to one of my favorite clips of all time. While driving her scooter in the bike lane one day, she would be passed by a car that she thinks almost hit her and decided to confront the man in a Taco Bell drive through Oh my God. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. Sir, hello. You almost hit me. You made a totally illegal move. Away from me, Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. Almost in life, I did not hit you. I said you almost hit me. You made an illegal. Get the off the street with that thing. You're in the street. It's not a car. That's not a car. It's a disability mobility. Go away. I did not hit you. I'm with my kids here. Go away. I have my two little boys here. Oh, and do you? And they're alive. You almost yeah, killed me. Not Donald Trump. Go away. I did not hit you. You should get out the street with that thing that you're riding. That guy wanted absolutely nothing to do with Mary, and his reaction to the absurdity is hilarious. Another one of my favorite clips of Mobility Mary is when she goes into an underpass that is blocked by a homeless camp. Well, this is cool. I can't do anything. I can't go anywhere. Great. Now I have to turn around on this narrow thing. Oh my god. Now, she had to see the state of the sidewalk before entering the overpass and still chose to drive down it for whatever reason, I don't know. And then, instead of reversing the whole way out, she tried to make this insane 70 point turn while moaning and crying the entire time. Mary's pedestrian antics have led her to almost being hit multiple times. Right in the middle of the crosswalk! Don't tell me 
what to do. You almost hit me. Oh my God. You idiot. I think you'll notice in almost every single one of these moments, she really wasn't in any danger, but she sure does love to act like she was. I think there was only one actual time where it looked like Mary almost got hit, but it was at night, it was very dark, and Mary doesn't have any lights or reflectors on her scooter. Oh my god! Sidewalk! Oh my god! Oh my god! If you killed me, it isn't going to make any difference how sorry you are. The car, I'm sorry. The car was about to hit me too. I'm so sorry. Well, better it hits me than hits you. No, Go away. I think the way Mary reacts to the woman stopping and offering her an apology is really telling. She just really thrives off being a victim. Well, better it hits me than hits you. No, Go away! In Mary's mind, she almost dies multiple times a day when venturing out into public. Lord almighty. Oh! Unbelievable. Listen, three times going up here, I almost got killed. And so far, two or three times going back, I've yeah. almost got killed. And I'm just jogging today. I oh, forget you about it. They don't care. You're they don't a target. Even let me cross the side You're a the target. Side. You're just a target. Like I said, she's a professional victim. This poor guy here was trying to sympathize with Mary, but she can't help but speak over him about how she almost died six times that day. Which I think it's really telling if you almost get hit by a car six times in your rascal scooter when driving across the street. I mean, I, I really start to wonder if, uh, if the cars are at fault here. Now, there was more to Mary than just her mobility scooter antics. She had a bird she loved named Lady Winston. Good morning. Ow. And she also tried to help the homeless, even though it really never went her way. And I don't really know how authentic these interactions are either, seeing that she decided to set up a camera and film her acts of altruism. Oh my god. Excuse me, I can't get by you. Excuse me? I can't get by you, I can't go over where the tree is. Thank you. Ma'am, I'm sorry, but I'm going to need you to move a little bit again. Oh, that's fine. And my friend here has has a little gift for you. Are you sure? Oh my goodness. Are you positive? What? Yeah, but I want to, because I can't eat it. It's things I can't eat, so they're, they're power bars. They're delicious, and, they, and you, you don't have to eat it right away. Oh, are you allergic to nuts? What if she went back and got you something like that with no nuts in it? Are you sure? Okay. Ma'am? I returned some bottles and I got $4.17. Do you want to take it over to Ralph's and redeem it? No. Okay. Huh? Okay. Thought you might want the money. I'm sure Mary would have wanted to be known as the altruistic woman that stood up for disabled people, but that's not the mark she left on the world. Sadly, this mobility menace is no longer with us. It is unclear how, or really if, Mary passed, but a thread on Reddit did some deep digging to discover that her house was sold on Zillow, allegedly by a realtor that specializes in selling homes for the deceased. Some other people like to speculate that she went out doing what she loves, terrorizing the streets of Los Angeles when she got hit by a car one day. However, there's only one article on this, and I don't know how serious it is. There is no obituaries or news articles that say a lady was hit and killed on a rascal scooter, so it's likely this is satire. This has been the story of Mobility Mary. Thank you so much for your time today and sticking around to this point. I really appreciate it. And a massive thank you to all of my channel members. I appreciate the hell out of your support. With all that being said, I'm Nick Nobody, and until next time, I'm out.